I put together this entire video using just AI. It's a man to challenge me. If he defeats me, we will be your subjects. If I win, you will serve us. I come to you in the name of God, whom you have defied. Today the Lord will deliver you into my hand. And on that day, David defeated Goliath. His victory song spread throughout Israel, and the king became jealous. David is a threat to my throne! Get him! David spends years hiding in the wilderness, narrowly escaping death as Saul relentlessly pursues him with his soldiers. So everything you just watched, including the music, are all generated from one AI tool to another. So stay with me and I will teach you everything you need to start making videos like this yourself, even if you're brand new to video creation. But why should you care about making videos like this? Well, AI-powered animation videos are a gold mine. People love storytelling videos, and these videos can teach incredible lessons to both adults and children. Don't believe me? Just look at this channel with 74,000 followers, raking thousands and millions of views with every video they post. They're simply telling Bible stories using AI. You could do this too if you pay attention right here. In this video, I'm going to walk you through each step on how I created the video you just watched so you can create your own captivating story videos with the help of AI at the end of the video. Here are the steps we'll cover. Creating our script, generating our images, turning our images into videos, generating voiceovers, creating lip sync to match our video's spoken words, putting it all together to make the final video. So grab your drink of choice and stick with me as we dive into these exciting steps. Step one, writing the script. First, we need to write a script for our video. We'll use ChatGPT to help us write a Bible story about King David in simple English. We'll ask ChatGPT to keep it under 2000 characters so it's not too long. In just a few seconds, our story is ready. Remember, I chose 2000 characters to keep it short, but you can make it longer if you want. By asking for simple English, it will be easy to understand. Once ChatGPT generates the story, we'll copy it and paste it into a Google Doc. To make it better, we'll separate each character's dialogue and write who is speaking at the start of each line. This will make it easier to record voiceovers for each character. Now, our script looks perfect. Step two, creating characters. Next, we need to create amazing AI-generated 3D images for each character in our video. We'll use a tool called Leonardo AI. If you have a paid chat GPT plan, you can also generate characters by clicking on Explore GPT and searching for the plugin, Consistent Characters GPT Fast and High Quality. For this video, we'll stick with Leonardo AI. Click the link in the video description to start with Leonardo AI. After logging in, you get 150 free tokens daily, enough for our character creation. Once logged in, click Launch app. In the dashboard, select Image Generation from the left menu. Under Preset Style, choose Game Concept 3D. For image size, click More and select 16 by 9. Perfect for YouTube videos. In Advanced Settings, choose Albedo Base XL. Now we're ready to create our characters. Step 2. Create the characters. Now let's guide Leonardo AI to create our main characters. Our story follows David as a boy, a teenager, and an adult, so we need three different images of David for each age range. The Bible says David had auburn hair, so let's ask Leonardo to create an image of a young boy between 18 and 20 years old with dark red hair in ancient Israel attire. In a few moments, Leonardo generates the perfect image. Click Download to save it to your computer. Repeat the process for David as a boy and as an adult. Next, let's create the main image for Giant Goliath. Give Leonardo the prompt, and in less than a minute, the image is ready. Repeat the process to generate all the other characters in the story. To make consistent character scenes, upload the main character images you previously generated. In the prompt box, click the image icon, select Character Reference, then upload our main character image. Enter a new prompt, click Generate, and wait a few moments. Your scene images will be ready using the original character reference. Repeat this process for all the scenes, ensuring consistency with the characters. When you're done, organize all the generated images in a folder to keep them neat. Just like that, 
all our images are ready. Step 3. Video Generation Before we continue, if you found this video helpful so far, please like and subscribe to our channel. Your support means a lot. Now let's bring our images to life by turning them into videos. We'll use a powerful AI tool called Dream Machine, recently released by Luma Labs. Dream Machine creates amazing video animations with depth, giving your images a 3D effect. With Dream Machine, you can generate up to 30 videos per month for free. I subscribed to a paid plan because I needed to generate over 100 images for different videos. Look at this video Dream Machine generated. It's almost perfect. To use Dream Machine, click on the link in the video description to get started. After logging in, you'll land on the main page. Click on the image icon and upload one of the images we generated with Leonardo AI. Let's start with our giant Goliath. Next, you can give it a prompt to tell it what to do with the image. You can also leave the prompt empty and Dream Machine will generate a video using its own directive. However, it's best to give it a prompt for better results. I'll give it a prompt and click Generate. If you're using the free version, your video might take a while to generate and could be queued for a long time. I found it's faster to generate videos on free accounts late at night Eastern Time. Since I'm using the paid version, this will be faster. So let's click Generate and wait a few moments. Our video is ready. Let's play, play it. it. As you can see, the video looks great. If you're not completely satisfied, you can re-upload the image, adjust the prompt and generate it again. If you like the video, click Download to save it. You can also extend the video length by clicking Extend and giving a new prompt for the longer part. Now, our videos are ready. Step 4. Add voiceovers. Let's make our video even more exciting with voiceovers. We'll use Eleven Labs, an amazing AI tool that makes text sound like real people. It has lots of natural sounding voices, so it won't sound robotic. You can find the link to Eleven Labs in the description below. First, open your Google document and copy the first speaker's dialogue. Then, go to Eleven Labs' website and paste the text into the box. Pick a voice you like. There are many options. Alternatively, click on Menu, then Voices and Library. You'll find tons of voices, including male, female and children's voices. You can also choose different accents like American, British, African, Australian and more. In the search box, let's search for Old Male. This will filter the voices that are Old Male, then listen to them and find the one that suits best. Let's select this as it suits our Prophet Samuel character very well. So add it to your library and go back to speech. Now, the voice you added to the voice library from here. Adjust the settings if needed and click Generate. In just a few seconds, your voiceover will be ready. Listen to it and download it if you like it. Next, do the same for our second speaker's dialogue. According to our story, the second speaker is Giant Goliath. Copy the second speaker's dialogue, paste it into 11 labs, delete the first dialogue and repeat the same process by finding a new suitable voice. Adjust the settings if needed and click Generate. After a few seconds, the voiceover will be generated. Download the new voiceover. Repeat this process for all the speakers. Use the same voice for each character throughout the video to keep it consistent. And just like that, our voiceovers are ready. Step 5. Character Lip Sync Now, we need to sync our character's lip movements with the voiceovers we created. While Dream Machine animates their mouths to move realistically, it doesn't automatically match them to the voices. That's where Synclabs comes in, a powerful AI tool that specializes in this task. To get started with Synclabs, click the link in the video description. Unfortunately, the free version of Synclabs adds a large watermark to your video, so it's better to subscribe to their paid plan. Alternatively, you can use Pika Labs, which is free with a more manageable watermark. Let's use Pika Labs to sync our character's lips. Click the link in the description to try out Pika Labs. After logging in, you'll land on the dashboard. Click on Image or Video, then upload the video you want to sync. Next, select Lip Sync, click to upload the voiceover, attach it and continue. Click Generate and wait a moment for it to process. I'll fast forward a bit and now our video is ready. Let's watch it. If he defeats me, we will be your subjects. If I win, you will serve us. Pretty cool, right? 
The Pika watermark is small, and we'll remove it in the next step. Final step, edit our video. Now let's use CapCut, an easy online video editing tool, perfect for beginners, to polish our final video. Click the link in the description to create a new account and get started. Once logged in, click Create Project and upload all your video and audio clips. Drag them onto the timeline and arrange them to fit the story flow. CapCut offers various transition effects to add style between segments. Experiment with different options to find the perfect one for your video. To enhance the video's impact, click Audio to add cool sound effects. You can import your own or use CapCut's built-in options. Drag each sound effect to the timeline beneath the video where needed. CapCut also allows easy addition of captions or subtitles for better accessibility and engagement. Go to the text menu, choose Auto Captions and explore different styles. Add animation to the text by clicking Animation and selecting your preference. Once everything looks good, click Save and let CapCut render your video. Then export the final version. Now that our video is complete, let's watch it together. In ancient Israel, God sent me to Jesse in Bethlehem to choose a king among his sons. God chose David, the youngest son, a shepherd boy. I secretly anointed him as king. Later, this happened. Choose a man to challenge me. If he defeats me, we will be your subjects. If I win, you will serve us. I come to you in the name of God, whom you have defied. Today the Lord will deliver you into my hand. And on that day, David defeated Goliath. His victory song spread throughout Israel, and the king became jealous. David is a threat to my throne. Get him! David spends years hiding in the wilderness, narrowly escaping death as Saul relentlessly pursues him with his soldiers. My lord the king... I spared your life today. You are more righteous than I. You have rewarded me with good, while I have rewarded you with evil. Years later, King Saul and his sons died, and David was finally crowned king of Israel, and God continued to be with him. That's all there is to it. By following these simple steps, you can create captivating 3D animated story videos and start building your YouTube presence. Remember, consistency is key. Keep uploading regularly and engage with your audience. So there you have it, a straightforward method to create money-making YouTube videos with 3D animation stories. If you found this helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel to support us. We'll continue sharing more tips to help you succeed. See you in the next video.